Mike here at Sky Include, keeping you included in the sky. You know, it started two years ago, uh, this this uh, YouTube channel and blog about keeping you included in a decentralized internet handshake and decentralized hosting. And, you know, right now we're moving into decentralized trading, uh, DeFi, crypto. You know, it's pretty interesting stuff. And I uh, just want to announce I'm also coming on as an ambassador for the Yellow Network. And today I'm going to introduce it and share some things and also try to help out others in the com various communities that I'm involved with, like Handshake and others. Because liquidity is an issue for a lot of communities in the Web3 and Internet world. So let me go through it skyclue.com slash yellow for the notes screenshots links etc as always um but basically i think a lot of people know the biggest problem in handshake especially is liquidity of the hns coin um we can show you but if you look on like one of these centralized exchanges like gate.io uh you know you can't buy that many you can't really sell so many although this looks like some bigger buyers here and also, this is blocked in uh, in various markets and things like that. And you know, people a lot of people can't use them. So, with we've been talking a lot about Akash. We have talked about Akash over the years uh, here. With uh, you know, Greg came on and we talked about that with decentralized hosting. We talked about Saya hosting, decentralized hosting. Of course, decentralized domains with Handshake. You know, ENS domains is another option, and uh, there's others, maybe Unstoppable, that are decentralized domains for you to put your websites. So the idea is content, right? What are you going to host on those websites? Of course, WordPress, skyinclude.com. We use WordPress to build. And so I've been kind of relating this yellow project to uh, WordPress, where you have where the .com. Is, this is like their exchange and the market uh marketplace but the dot org is like wordpress.org this is franchising trading businesses which is pretty cool right so you can set up your own node or you can set up your own exchange your own retail broker is the word i've gone through the white paper of course i'm involved with this project so it's, i'm excited about it i've talked to a lot of the team members and uh it's it's very complex, you know. I told took me like a week or two studying. I went through and you know, all the documentations, and I do think there's opportunities for all of us here. So that's what I'm going to go through today. So the idea is you could install this, you can install this uh, when it's ready. Version four, Openware. They merge the Openware, and you can then plug in on your own server, like of course Amazon or maybe Akash, any kind of server hosting and domain your own domain, subdomain, you know, TLD, SLD, whatever, and become an exchange, become like a gate.io, all right? Um, and here's where it gets interesting is I, it's not really a DEX and it's not really a, what is it, SEX, <laughs> CEX, centralized exchange, it's both. So the idea is there's these um, nodes or retail brokers so you can set up your own you can install it on your own server and people can set up a uh, trade on your exchange so it'll look it will look like something like this this is an example alpha.yellow.org and hopefully it loads it was just loaded there it is so you can set up something like this they'll give you this framework you could install this you know uh, on your own hosting and you can then plug in your own coins or the coins that exist in their liquidity networks and then become a trade uh, a trading platform and i'm excited about this for handshake because i i believe there's a ways to add handshake into this so um i need some help from the community on that one but let me go back to my document or my it'll be a blog post but imagine a world where anybody can be a broker anybody can be an exchange you know, something like this yellow, you can install a framework, Openware, OpenDAX is the technical product name of the Openware software. Version 4 will be the one with this token, and then you plug in the liquidity into it, and then you can start to earn uh, the commissions or the trade fees from the trades on that network. And, you know, some people said, oh, it's, it is an Ethereum ERC-20 token right now. Yellow is the ticker. It's not yet out yet. Uh, I know a lot of people always want it on, like, I follow Cosmos. Some people want it on, like, you know, 
pancake swap or um, other ones. But I um, I want to say it doesn't. I don't want to say it doesn't matter. But it's a B two B token. Okay, it's a B two B use. You don't need it to trade. Just like it's a, basically when you install this on your website. This is not using like an on-chain decentralized exchange. This is a centralized exchange, just like Gate.io or others, right? And here, you're not paying a gas fee to buy or sell, right? You're trading on their, on their server, on their platform, okay? So it can be, um, there's no fee. Uh, there's the percent fees like a centralized exchange has, but there's not like this gas fee of the yellow token, yellow token is for the uh for the b2b so if you want to set this up on your own server and be a node or be an ex a retail broker you'd need 250,000 yellow token to deposit into a smart contract at a minimum to then be able to set this up into the liquidity network okay so it's uh you wouldn't need to trade it on every single buy sell trade in there in your exchange like on here right this is just trading like a centralized exchange so i hope i hope we can figure out within the handshake community a way to use this for trading handshake coins so you can read my notes here and i put some things but the big keyword we gotta learn is about state channels okay state channels is the way uh this works so it's a mesh network it's off chain off chain um these trades right this is just like an decentralized exchange right it's not these trades are not on a on a blockchain these trades are locally in gate same with the way yellow network trades will work it'll be like on that hosting if you're on aws or on your on google cloud or you're on akash you all those trades are in your database as the exchange and the customer the only on-chain parts are the i call on-ramp and off-ramp meaning somebody wants to connect their wallet and trade they deposit the collateral or their deposit into your exchange just like if you sign up for say gate io you have to uh deposit coin into it right but the difference is it's locked in a smart contract that yellow is helping regulate so it protects the customer from the exchanges the not your keys not your coin problem so it's kind of a hybrid between a centralized exchange and a decentralized exchange if that makes sense but the idea is it's open so we could as a handshake community could use this state channel to set up a channel to then deposit hns and allow others to trade that liquidity and I need some help. This is maybe my first video. Maybe I'll make more. But the idea is we could allow people to use this to trade, right? And um, you can read some blogs, but I, I found some. Uh, of course, this is just my Google Docs. This would be a blog post on skyinclude.com slash yellow or setup.skyinclude slash yellow on handshake domains. And I'm going to, of course, cite this. There was a really good post that just came on the yellow blog uh, from Julie literally just a couple days ago it's a long one i recommend reading about high frequency trading but the part i highlight further down is the state channels this is what i think is a critical thing to learn and this is a critical difference i believe with uh this yellow network uh, because it's not happening on chain all right that's why i believe handshake could be put into this and i believe other uh small coins or people that don't have liquidity or can't get paid these listing exchanges pay binance pay you know coinbase or whatever their listing fees or their backdoor deals or whatever it is you can just put it in here so i need to learn this more and maybe i'll make another video or you, i'm hoping people here can understand it but basically uh not every transaction is on is uh, on a node validation it doesn't happen on chain Right, so it's basically the as I said earlier, it's like depositing and off. Depositing is the on-chain st smart contract, but when you take out, it sees all your trades and it says, "Oh, you've made or you've lost," so you can take out, like kind of like <laughs> I guess it's like a casino, right? But uh, I guess trading is a gam gambling, right? So of course, dude, don't uh, invest more as always, and uh, that you can lose. But that's for not really you as the platform as a node. Uh, as the exchange, that's of course for your clients, your users. But state channels is the thing we need to learn. 
So I've already talked to Thomas and uh, talking to Matt Zipkin. I'm trying to talk to some others about trying to get a handshake maybe to leverage this so that instead of having to use these small uh, centralized exchanges that are blocked in a lot of countries, you could then have this on to a um, on your own exchange. Imagine imagine it being a decentralized host, decentralized domain, you know, and then you're able to trade with your wallet. So it's again something I'm still learning, but I, I believe this is an awesome new uh, way of bridging Web two to Web three is what what it says. So the idea is um, maybe traditional financial companies that want to start to add crypto could then set up like a domain on their website, a subdomain, say, and it's like crypto.brokeragefirm.com. And then they could plug this in and of course put that collateral and then let their clients or their users or anybody on the internet to trade. So I, I see this as really an exciting time. Uh, and another use of, you know, needing a decentralized domain like a handshake name or needing decentralized hosting. Of course, you could do this all on a normal domains and normal hosting. Uh, but of course, as some feel, there might be risks in that. Uh, it's a little bit last minute, but I think this will go out Monday. I'm doing it over the weekend, but uh, this video will go on, on Tuesday at 2 p.m. Uh, Central European time, which is 8 p.m. my time in Asia, GMT plus 8. And uh, it'll be early in the morning in the U.S. We're going to do an AMA. I'll be the host. We have uh, a, a lot of great team members there uh, doing it. And let's uh, see you there. And it will be on their official Telegram group, t.me slash yellow underscore org. You can see me in that group too, and I'll be hosting. It'll be audio only, and uh, maybe you can ask some questions on the Twitter thread, and I'd like to see you there. And my last part is, you know, I love your feedback. You know, we're all going on this crypto rabbit hole and this Web3 rabbit hole with hosting and domains, and now this kind of like plug-and-play exchanges. Imagine you have a handshake name that's relevant to this kind of these, these kind of brokerages. Imagine you can set these up and you can start to monetize your uh, your domains and, and your network and your customers. Um, so I'd love your feedback. Uh, and I'll be working closely with this, with this network. And uh, see you there. Bye.